Join Douglas Macmillan every Sunday afternoon at 2 for an hour of music and song from the Celtic nations and beyond. In traditional and modern styles and in languages both native and adopted, hear the Celtic world brought right to your home through the magic of radio. That's Celtic World, Sundays at 2 on Otago Access Radio, 105.4 FM and 1575 AM and online at www.oar.org.nz. Celtic World. I'm your host Douglas McMillan. There was a Welsh band Tsunami formed in 2010 in Dolgethau in mid Wales with their 2012 single Ira. Next up it's uh, E Bandana with Murray Soul, a single from 2014. Safe in no, we need my soul. 
Okay, next up it's uh, Candleass with Goriad Heb Glow from the 2014 album Bodolin Distor. This is a five piece band from, oh, let me try and pronounce this, Flanu Withlin. Flanu Withlin, sorry, in North Wales. Take it away, boys. Time now for a track from uh, singer-songwriter Catherine Herbert, a track called Ari Flynn, from a 2011 album, Igwea Igai Afopeth Rung I Thou, which I think means the truth, lies, and everything in between. And I like that deer, quality I quit. I gave you another wet ice, gave you a fred or a rise.
Next track is from a five-piece band from Carnarvon, and it's from their 2015 EP Haydn. Here's Eru with Gwel Nahin. <laughs> I'm 
ندر لال بان بان را شاول شاروخ ترت تانوخ کوئر پیتو که تلفن نو هست برو پسی بر روی آرشکن و ما کوپای سامفیر دیتو کویدی در پنیا به دارو آن را دیم کوار فهر ویز تانی تی دگوش نه This next artist is quite an interesting character. She's the daughter of the singer of uh, Welsh language progressive rock band from the 70s, Bran. Um, she's a singer-songwriter in her own right and a presenter on the Welsh language TV channel S4C. From Anglesey, here's Ellen Fleur with a track from her 2008 album Havana, Garth Callan.
Listening to Celtic World on Otago Access Radio, 105.4 FM. Quite a retro sounding song that one, Colorama with Dere Mern from their 2008 album Magic Lantern Show. Next up it's uh, a band formed in 2013 in Bangor, North Wales. And this is a track from their 2014 EP Kali Kusk, here's Ira Ira with Kragen. <laughs> Der Kragen han dimen gar trai mi. Und dann ser sin do die men, ar Kragen han dirin ik betskeni, betskeni. Ar betskeni. Pandwitali boini, panados ra ai dimi.
Next up is a band headed by singer-songwriter and uh, S4C TV presenter Ian Gwyneth. Here's Eus Gwyneth, if I'm pronouncing that correctly, which I'm sure I'm not, much to the merriment of the Welsh-speaking listeners. Um, anyway, uh, 2014, this came out, Delphinol. <laughs>
Next up, it's singer Gweno Saunders from Cardiff, who goes simply by the name Gweno. Here's a track from a 2012 debut album, and it's one heck of a word to pronounce, just trying to read it. Mbelidreth. Mbelidreth. Mbelidreth? Hmm, let's hear. Another presenter now, our third in the show, but this time a presenter on uh, Welsh radio station Heart FM. He's from uh, Flandudno or Clandudno. I think that depends on whether you come from North or South Wales, whether it's Fl or Cl. He's a singer and musician as well as being a presenter. And here from his 2013 album E Daith is Alistair James with Mandra. the 
Time now for an eight-piece band. That's quite a few members. Formed in 2014 in Anglesey with a track from their 2015 album, oh, just last year. Nolak Imlane. Nolak Imlane. Okay. <laughs> Here's Kalfari with Ruth. <laughs> Quer da truia truz Tim troita Kevin na Tim Covin noite em chur A rei tem cabla quas A rei tem cabla quas e vende o alta bit
Pretty much running out of time here on Celtic World for another show. You've been listening to Otago Access Radio 105.4 FM and 1575 AM. This and all shows can be streamed live or downloaded as podcasts. Just visit the website at www.oar.org.nz to find out more. Additionally, if you wish to subscribe to this or any other show, Try and find them on iTunes and the latest episode will be uploaded to your iTunes library automatically. Now to end the show now, on rather a sad note, we have a band here from uh, Llanroost in North Wales. They formed in 1984 but disbanded in 1992 when they realised they couldn't achieve mainstream success singing in the Welsh language. It really is a shame but I think listening to the show today in totality and and seeing how much recent stuff has come out, I think one could still be heartened that there is enough interest in Welsh language music for it to be a viable career. I don't think uh, any artist singing in a minority language is necessarily going to become rich and famous as singers do in our more widespread languages, particularly English. But nevertheless, I think what we've heard today is very worthy and definitely worthy of recognition. Yeah, anyway, after that little rant, here's Ikrif with Cymru Flogger a Thlan Roost from way back in 1989. I hope you enjoyed this programme and thanks for listening.